Hi, I'm Diego Alonso with DiegoAlonsoGuitar.com and today we're going to focus on the arpeggio technique in flamenco guitar. There are lots of different arpeggio patterns out there, so we're just going to limit it to one for this video. It's going to be the backward arpeggio, which is P, A, M, I. So it's thumb, ring, index, middle finger. I'll do a quick demo at the beginning, and then as always, I'll do a close-up to break the technique down for you. First thing you want to do is understand the movement of the finger. Okay, the movement of the finger is not a way, you're not really plucking the guitar away, you're going upward. Okay, so the way to do that is isolate each finger first. So, thumb on the sixth string, we're going to put our eye finger only on the first string. Okay, and just let your tip joint relax a little bit and just move up. So go ahead and try to rake all the strings up. Okay? It's almost like you want your index finger to hit your wrist, right? And not, not forcefully, but just that's the direction you want to go. So always remember, remember to remain light. Okay? So you keep doing that and angle forward a little bit. Angle forward a little bit until you just hit one string. Okay? That's your angle and that's the exact movement of the finger up so it's upward and away not just away all right mostly up okay so you do that with each finger 10 times per finger till you get the right movement then isolate the next one just your m finger plant first get your rake so you make sure you're going in the right direction and then start angling forward till you miss all the strings except the one you want to play same thing with your a finger okay so the arpeggio that I was doing most of the time in that demo was the what's called the backward arpeggio. It's P, A, M, and I. All right. You want to make sure first that you have your setup correct. So I plant my hands like my four on the four on the guitar, just like the other demos. So P on the sixth string, and then I on the third string, M on the second string, A on the first string. All right. What you want to be careful of not of doing is not doing that. You, you want to make sure your fingertips are to the right of the thumb. What you want to make sure you have is a triangle of space between your thumb and your index. Right? It doesn't have to be one of these triangles. Any kind of triangle is fine, but that needs to be there. So if I do that, you can see it a little bit clearly there, right? So plant those fingers on those strings. You can have a tiny triangle, you can have a wider triangle, whatever's more comfortable for you, but the triangle needs to be there. You need to make sure your index fingertip is to the right inside your thumb. All right? What you can do is you can rotate, look at my forearm, rotate my forearm, slide my fingers back to get that position. All right? So for the P A M I, the backward arpeggio, we want to do this. Plant our fingers first, now release I and M. So the only fingers planted. Are P and A, okay? I'm gonna mute the guitar with my left hand. First thing I'm gonna do is a free stroke with the thumb for now, okay? All right, so it's gonna be P and then A, M, I. Right? P, A, M, sorry, P, A, M, I. So. A on the first string, M on the second string, I on the third string, okay? Again, super slowly and relax. We're not going for volume or strength. We're going for lightness and the correct movement, so it corrects out. As you get more comfortable with that, you can go faster. Okay, like I was doing at the very end. Uh, the other thing that is always an option is to do a rest stroke with a thumb. That is totally valid depending on what 
what notes you want to come out more. Okay, if you want the bass notes to come out more, which I did because the melody was in the bass in that demo, then I wanted to do a rest stroke and I want to lighten up on these fingers. Okay, so both of them are valid rest stroke AMI or free stroke AMI. Okay, thanks for watching. For more information on in person lessons in Chicago, Illinois, or online lessons, visit me at diawalonsoguitar.com or on Facebook, facebook.com forward slash diawalonsoguitar. Thanks.